Smoking all day Night comes on, I hear I am Every night it's the same And now I think it's that you're miles away Thunder, so come back another day experimented with other musicians and other bands and then two years ago from a songwriting um, exercise that Tony and myself put ourselves into mm -hmm. we wrote the songs and then the album grew and then from the album the band was built Outside of Australia, and the people have been warmer than anywhere else in the, in the world, or even at home. Um, we are up for adoption, so we have to I think it's, we have to embrace it like Spotify and iTunes, they're sending our music out faster to other people where it costs us a lot more money fly over personally, play the song, and fly back. So I think it encourages people to, to like you faster or dislike you faster. There's good and bad, you know, to having iTunes out there. Um, some people who maybe uh, not technologically minor or advanced who are a bit older or don't even uh, you know want to put their credit card details for example online to buy things. Well, like we had at the show that we played last night. There were things. Kangas. Salah Kangas. Salah something Kangas. There were people in the crowd singing words to the songs and I guess if it wasn't for things like iTunes and Spotify they wouldn't sing anything. Because being an independent band as well, we, uh, we control all of our you know, record sales and shipping overseas as much as we can. So we would have obviously recognised sales over here to then go up. Or well, they're buying the actual physical copy, but that didn't happen. So we have assumed that they bought from online, you know. And whilst the percentages of what we earn isn't the best, but um, it's still <laughs> CDs, they're, they're a one-use item, but they're only probably good for whacking into your Mac and taking the songs down from that way, or for, some, for signing for nostalgia. Yeah, so I think it, it also encourages the live show attendance, because people can download the record, look at the website, but you can't get the feeling of the gig unless you're at the gig. So, you know, the thing that a small band from Australia can come here for the first time and people sing the song, that's fantastic. They'll come to the gig, it's there, yeah, so I think it's a good thing.
you if we all quit our jobs and we have jobs. <laughs> if we all quit our jobs and just did that, you probably could, but it would be hard going. Yeah. In Australia especially. You couldn't in Australia. Australia. Without without radio play and some sort of national exposure. Mm -hmm. Probably with the birds are working class rock and roll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's yeah. that's almost a stamp on it. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's the headline. <laughs> working class rock. We're going to come back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 